Shout out to the WTC gang. For we back with another banker. Let me tell you something, Charles Woods. You better stay single until God send you somebody real. I mean, any red flags, you got to ghost these people like Casper the Ghost. Just like the people in the past who ghosted you. Oh, them tables turn real quick, don't it? <laughs> but I'm going to tell you, I'm enjoying this single life, baby. I'm not in a rush for nothing. Hit that like button if you single and you chose it. Hit that like button if you enjoying the single life. Come on, talk to me. Have you guys complaining about being alone? I love it. I got a peace of mind. I got my joy, unspeakable joy, baby. I ain't got nobody trying to pull me down. I ain't got to worry about if I'm sleeping with the enemy or not. I'm staying single until God send me somebody real. You got to realize, chosen ones, they don't make them like you no more. You can't just be dating anybody. Come on, talk to me. You can't just be hooking up with just anybody. <laughs> you got to realize while you're on this quest of finding your true love, enjoy it. Get to know people. Let people talk. You move in silence. When you're on a date, you just be just as humble as you know how to be. But enjoy yourself. Be harmless as a dove, but wise as a serpent. Let everybody all up on, on you and on your energy and all up on you. Because you got to realize you're valuable. You're special. Come on now, you are, are really a divine one. You are a spiritual being, baby. And they just don't make them like you anymore. So my message is to the chosen one, stay single, man. Stay single. Until God really send you somebody real. We live in our last and evil days where it's really hard to find somebody real. It's hard to find somebody who's genuine. It's hard to find somebody, amen, who going to love like you, that unconditional love that I'm going to give you the shirts off my back kind of love. I'm telling you, we're getting ready to say, when you're going through the struggle, guess what? I'm going to go through it with you. When you need prayer, I'm going to pray for you. It's hard to find that nowadays. And a lot of people, guess what? They just take, take, take. They're not reciprocating no same energy back to you. They're not mirroring you. Nobody mirroring the same energy to you. They're not reciprocating the same energy back to you. Guess what? You got to ghost them like Casper the ghost. I understand something I'm getting ready to say. I'm talking about, man, it feels so good. Amen. To do the rejecting now. It feels so good to be turning them all down. You're going to have to turn down a lot of people because a lot of people don't really love God like they say they do. Come on, talk to me. A lot of people ain't really genuine like they say they are genuine. You got to just be quiet. Shut your mouth and just listen to people talk. And eventually them true colors go come out. Listen, what comes out of the mouth, the heart speaks. So let me tell you something, ladies. Just because the brother might be looking good on the outside, come on, talk to me. Just because he might have a fancy car, Queens. I'm talking to my chosen sisters. Let me tell you something. You got to pay attention to that brother's heart. Y'all be going for the brother's bag. What he do for a living. Can you take care of me for the rest of my life? And you not even know he getting ready to hit you upside the head and, and boss you around. You got to pay attention to people's spirits, queens. You got to pay attention to people's hearts. Come on and talk to me. Do he even love God? I'm telling y'all, man, we getting ready to figure this out. Welcome to the first video of finding your true love. Because you got to realize, man. You are from God in the heavens above. You are from heaven, chosen queens. And don't you let me get on my chosen kings. Where my big dogs at? Where the kings who sitting on their throne right now? Who not going to just accept anything? Come on, talk to me. You got to be very wise when you're dealing with a woman, kings. I'm talking to the chosen men out there. You know I'm not hating on you. Come on and talk to me. You got to realize what you have, kings, the strength that you have, the knowledge of wisdom and understanding that you have, kings. I know something I'm getting ready to say. Be careful with these women because you got to think about it in the Bible. What brought down great men? What brought down so many kings? A woman. Pay attention. Don't you dare, amen, say I do if you really not really feeling that. Come on, talk to me. You got to go with your first intuition. Go with your first mind. Come on, don't you let nobody force you into marrying them, amen. Force you into spending the rest of your life with them. And you come to, come to find out now they're getting ready to ghost you. Now they're getting ready to divorce you because they just wanted you for your bread, kings. 
And I'm back to the chosen kings and the queens. When you find in your true love, you got to stay single and love yourself. Because guess what? How can you love somebody? Amen. How can you love somebody else if you don't even love yourself? Come on, talk to me. Y'all taking this serious. I'm not taking it serious. I'm going to relax and enjoy. And whatever God has for me, he has for me. Come on and talk to me. But we, we can't always be introverts. Get out here and go have a good time. Get out here and, and, and go to a couple lounges. Go to a couple rooftops. Rooftop lounges. Come on and talk to me. We don't do no clubs. Come on, when you chosen, you don't do club. That's when you know you're really chosen. But we go where they're playing some good jazz. Come on and talk to me. We go where they're playing some real good old soul for R&B. Come on and talk to me. And don't get this with it. We might go where they're playing gospel all day. We'll go to a gospel concert in a heartbeat. Other than I'm getting ready to say, sometimes God will send you to a gospel concert to find your true love. Can I get a witness up in here? So let me tell you something, man. You got to realize, man, these people with true colors going to come out. God going to be giving you all kind of warning signs, red flags. Amen. And then you have to ghost these people just like the people in the past ghosted you. Come on. How many of y'all was just so real to your ex? You were so real to them. You gave them everything. You gave her everything. And guess what? They still ghosted you. It seems like no matter what you do. Amen. Somebody, amen. They always got their eyes on something else. But how many know that God will send you somebody they only got their eyes on you? Come on, talk to me. You need somebody they got their eyes on you. They want the best for you. They're going to pray for you. Because ain't nobody real out here anymore. And I'm getting sick of it. Understand what I'm getting ready to say. It seems like people just want you for your money. Come on. They don't even ask you what's your favorite color no more. They don't care, care less about your favorite color. <laughs> they don't even know your birthday. Come on. But they're trying to get your social security. Come on, they're trying to get you to sign something for them. Come on and talk to me. Trying to get you to be a co-signer. But let me tell you something, man. You got to realize that guess what? As long as you got King Jesus, you don't really need nobody. So anybody that's coming to your life is just an extra blessing from God. Come on, talk to me. So you got to realize that you are the prize and you are in the movement all by yourself. Glory be to God. And you and God are a force when you're together. Come on, can I get a witness in the building? So let me tell you something, man. You're going to find out that a lot of people, guess what? They got the same body, but guess what? They got different spirits. Come on and talk to me. Everything that glitters ain't gold. Come on, use your brain, chosen kings. Everything that look good on the outside, everything that glitters and is shining, shining and looking good. Come on, talk to me. It ain't gold. You'd be surprised everything that smell good. Guess what? It ain't gold. Come on and talk to me. Looks can be deceiving. The devil know how to trick you real good. He'll put something in your face that you like on the outside. But you're not even on the inside. They evil. They conniving. They get ready to turn their back on you. They get ready to stab you in, in your back with a butcher knife. Can I get a witness? And, and Queens, you got to be more careful as well. Let me tell you something, Queens. You are God's most best creation ever made. You know, I'm going to keep it 100 with you. I'm talking to the chosen Queens that really got a good spirit. They got good energy. They got a positive attitude that, that's out here running things. They got their own business. You doing your thing right now. Don't just settle for any Negro. Y'all doing too much. Seems like y'all like to get to what's on the opposite. Y'all need somebody that's like you. God fear like you. Because let me tell you something, man. Out here just dating any ain't going to get you, amen, to your next destination. You'd be surprised how many people will block you from you actually meeting your soulmate, from actually you meeting your husband and your wife. Come on, you got to put that playmate to the side. Come on, talk to me. Stay single until God find you somebody real. See, my people want you to do, do, do for them. And guess what? They want to just give you a little, you know what I'm saying, a little something, something in return. Come on, some a little treat. I got a, I got a little treat for you. This is a treat. No, it ain't no treat. I can care less about that used up treat. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Just go for the men and the women. We all used up. Let's keep it 100. We all filthy rags on our best day. <laughs> Let's keep it 100. Y'all thinking like y'all fresh off the womb. No, you ain't fresh no more. Let's keep it 100. We ain't perfect, but we worth it. Come on, let's keep it 100. Oh, this is a treat. You'd be surprised how many people try to manipulate you and gaslight you to doing this and that. You breaking your neck. You paying bills. You doing it. They tell me, oh, yeah, I got something for you. Over a little 30-second feeling. Knock it off. 
Because once you get your little 30 second feeling on, you coming right back to your senses. Knock it off. Understand what I'm getting ready to say. Knock it off. And when you chosen, it's not about that. We want to know about you and what you what you really believe in. Do you really believe in God? What are your beliefs? Do you walk in the fear and that mission of God? Do you got a good heart? How do you treat other people? These are the questions I ask when I go on dates. They be looking at me crazy. And I'm just, I'm just kicking back laughing. Come on and talk to me. Because I know exactly what I want. And what you want is what you want. I'm telling you, I'm ghosting people. When God give me a red flag, oh man, I will ghost you in a heartbeat. You won't even know I existed. Because I'm just too valuable to be settling. I done been there and done that. Time is winding out. I don't need nobody in my life that's going to keep talking about their problem. You're constantly talking about your ex. I don't want to hear nothing about your ex. And I don't want you to know anything about mine. How many single real ones am I talking to right now? You can't even get to know the person without them telling them about their ex. I'm talking about, man, I will hang up the phone in a heartbeat. <laughs> they be like, where did he go? Oh, you can just imagine the look on their faces when you hang up. I think it was a bad call. Let me call him back. And when they call you back, please leave a message for her. Oh, he gone. Jordan and Chosen One is gone. Because I know what I bring to the table. So you got to realize, Chosen One, what you bring to the table before you even settle with anybody. You got your own everything. This for the Chosen One that got their own everything. You on top of your game right now. You can't just settle for anything. Life is so beautiful. So, man, life is just worth living. But you got to get out there and start living. And we got to stop being introverts. I'm going to keep it 100 with you. I can't remember the last time I went out. I can't remember the last time I went out. We can't be introverts all our life, chosen ones. That's when you know you really chosen is when you were introvert. Because we don't want to deal with no different spirits, demonic spirits out there. People with two faces and acting weird and shady and carry on low vibrational spirits. That's what makes the chosen ones an introvert. But we can't be an extrovert. Don't get it twisted. But you know how we are. We move in silence. And we move when it's time to move. It's okay to go out there, have a good time, socialize, spend time. You know, if you want to spend time with family, friends, whatever, it's okay. But you got to know when to move. That's the difference. You can't hang out too long. Even when you're going out having a good time, you're going dancing with, with a couple of friends. Hey, I get back with y'all. It was really nice, you know, hanging out with y'all because guess what? You got bigger and better things to do anyway. Oh, and the devil, oh, he loved to come up in there at around 12 o'clock. You ever heard that saying, make sure you make it home by 11.59? Come on and talk to me. Make sure you make it to the house by 11.59. Let me tell you, if I'm going out dancing, I'm the first one entering and I'm the first one leaving. Can I get a witness? Because that's when spirits start roaming around. I don't got time. But I do want to go, go out there and, and get my boogie on. I do want to go and have a good time. But now you got to really know how to move speedily and quickly. Now when you go out, you got to really watch your surroundings. You got to really stay prayed up now when you go out. Even when they checking you at the door, you got to be careful for nothing. In all things, through prayer and through supplication. Don't go in there acting all crazy. Go in there in your right frame of mind. You got to realize you're still the light that is surrounded by darkness. Now we're on the quest of finding our love, so be ready for more content. Because I'm telling you, Mr. Limited is back. You're going to find your true love. I pray that God's in your good wife and a good husband, somebody you can spend the rest of your life with. Because out here being single for the rest of your life it ain't, it ain't, really, it ain't really it like that. But we're going to take and enjoy the single life while we're young and while we have it. Because you done been through too much. It's, it's your season to start loving yourself anyway. Don't you dare put nobody else before you. I'm telling you, I done been through it. They will ghost you. It don't matter what you do for people. So since you want to ghost me, okay, it's all good. Now God has made you into the chosen one. He has transformed you. Come on, he elevated you. Now you just sit back and now you starting to do some rejecting. Come on, talk to me. Now you the one that's turning them down. When I mean, tell you, chosen ones, they're coming after you. Oh, everybody wants you now. Because guess what? You're the underdog. You're the diamond in the rough. And people are starting to realize who you really are. Pay attention. Now people are starting to hit us up and trying to get to know us and all this. No, I remember you rejected me in high school. I don't even want nobody from high school. Why would I want anybody from high school? 
Half of y'all don't even look the same. Let's keep it 100. Half of y'all still 40 years old, still living with your mama. Come on, I need somebody that's on my level. Don't you be afraid to put in the comment below and say, it's levels to this, man. Come on and talk to me. We got to learn to stop settling. We got to learn to stop just, just dating any. Because you ain't just anybody. You are somebody special. And it's a difference, man. Come on and talk to me. So I just want to let you guys know to all my single ones out there. Man, stay single until God send you somebody real, man. I'm talking about their energy, their personality. And don't, don't get it twisted. They looks too, man. Got all these women out here. They want a real, they want a real, you know, you know what I'm about to say? They want a real Negro. But guess what? You got a fake body. Come on, it don't match, honey. I'm talking about you got to, everything got to be real, real on the outside. Come on now, we ain't doing no plastic surgeries. We ain't doing none of that. I want somebody natural, God-fearing, who, who love to cook, who really love the Lord, who love gospel music just like I love gospel music. Come on and talk to me. I want somebody, amen, who preach just like I preach too. If you want me to keep it 100 with you. You need somebody that's on your level that love, either, either they, they, if they, if they don't do what you do, at least they're going to support you on what you're doing. Half y'all hooking up with people because of how they look. Half y'all hooking up with people because of how much money they got. But when it's all come, shit hit the fan, they ain't going to have your back. When you really need somebody to talk to, they ain't going to be there. Come on, talk to me. They're going to keep on ghosting you and go to the next Negro and go to the next woman. Bye. It's 8 billion people in the world. Bye. I'm going to be fine by my lonesome. Trust me, once you start enjoying your own company, once you start, hey man, just start loving yourself, encouraging yourself, motivating yourself, I promise you, man, everything going to go up. Go to the gym. Work out. God might see your husband and wife while you working out. They might be next to you. You don't even know. Go work out. Go to the gym. It's time to live. But don't take it so serious. If it didn't work, it didn't work. Bye. I'm good. I'm not taking nothing serious like that when it comes to dating. Because you got to realize, man. If somebody real, you're going to know it. You're going to feel it on them. But enjoy it. Leave your options open. Don't be a fool and put throw all your eggs in one basket. You know I'm going to keep it 100 with you. Let me repeat that. Don't you be a fool and throw all your eggs in one basket. Because when you chosen, we got options. Let's keep it 100. Ain't no sugar coating. This is 2024. We got options. And people get mad because you got options. Oh, well... I'm getting to know these people. I ain't doing nothing with these people. I'm getting to know these people. And don't just let anybody get up all up on you. You protect that, chosen ones. Protect them goodies. That's Come on, that's for somebody real. I'm starting to realize some stuff. People carry spirits. Y'all really want to talk about it? Let's talk about it. Y'all just sleeping with any. Oh, it look good. Oh, come here. Y'all just, use, just using things as an object. No, 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 no. People carry on spirits, and them spirits will really jump on you. Listen to me. Gotta be very careful who you're sleeping with, man. It's an energy exchange, man. What are y'all doing? And you wonder why you don't even feel like yourself. You wonder why, hey, man, now you you going crazy because this person ain't, ain't called you, ain't did it. Man, I'm trying to tell you what's going on. It's an energy exchange. And you'd be surprised on the energy that people carry on them. And you want them touching on you and rubbing on you. And that devil is a liar. Understand what I'm getting ready to say? You better learn how to, hey man, just, just it, sit back and be cool and stay prayed up. That's the only way you're going to resist temptation is, is staying in, in, in the will of God and staying prayed up. You know, I'm going to keep it real because it, it ain't easy. But you got to learn how to protect your body, protect yourself. People carry on spirits. And people carry diseases. We live in our lives in evil days. Well, people, hey man, I'm telling you, they're carrying all kinds of stuff. You got to stay off the way. But enjoy yourself at the same time. Take your time with these people. Get to know them. 
All it takes is, to be honest with you, all it really takes is one conversation. When you chosen, you know God gave us the spirit of discernment. We have to start ghosting people right away. I'm talking about, man, I'm really ghosting people left and right. It feels so good. It's, I'm not even mad about it. I'm not about to waste my time and end up in no mess, no drama. I'm not about to go in there. All you got to do is be quiet and listen. Oh, you'd be surprised. Silence is very powerful. That's one of your weapons you got to use when you're dating. Stop trying to take over the conversation all the time. Let them talk. Be quiet. Come on, be humble and sit your ass down and enjoy this good steak. Just be humble. And eventually that true color is going to come out. I'm telling you how this works. Trust people to be to, to be who they are. And when they show you who they are, just know when you see them, believe them. When you see their true colors, you got to believe that's them. Because the only person that can change people is God. And stop listening to all these people. Oh, you know, I love the Lord. Oh, yes, I love him with all my heart. Yes. You Christian? Oh, I'm Christian too. Ooh, they play that role real good. They know something special about you. Come on. They know, they see generational wealth written on your forehead. Don't you be, don't you be a fool. The Bible says, be not ignorant concerning Satan and his devices. Listen to me. Be aware of these wolves and sheep clothing. Come on. They wear straight full blown mask. Come on. Then you got people, I'm telling you, man, they wearing all this different makeup. Women, they don't take all that now. Now y'all wearing double layers and double layers of makeup. They don't take all that. And then when you take off the makeup, they look like a totally different person. Y'all better wake up and smell the, smell the coffee. You better wake up and smell the chosen one this. Because when you're chosen, you don't really need all that. Come on and talk to me. We natural. Come on and talk to me. You got to pay attention to the people's spirits, to their energy. Their energy don't lie. And you're looking at a brother, I'm trying to tell you, man, I've been there and done that. I'm talking about I had the baddest of the baddest. Do you understand what I'm saying? I had the baddest of the baddest. I understand what I'm saying. But guess what? Their spirit wasn't right. Their energy wasn't right. They wouldn't know my frequency. Come on and talk to me. And you got to realize when you are in a season of celebrating yourself, oh, they're going to run from you. That's why they ghost you. I just want to let you know that. <laughs> when you are in the season of celebrating yourself, listen to me, when you're on that high frequency, oh, man, they're going to run from you because they fear you. They're afraid of you. You're too much. Y'all get mad because people leaving you. Bye. That's less stress and less drama. Bye. I can do all bad all by myself. Come on and put it in the comments below. My single tone will say, I can do all bad all by myself. I don't need you. Bye. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Bye. Once you get in that mode, oh, there ain't nothing stopping you. Let me tell you something. I used to be the person keeping 100 with you. You know, just want people to stay. You can't beg nobody to stay with you. That was me. I was so loving and I put so much energy into people. Oh, stay with me, baby. What's up? Why are you acting different? That was me when I was younger. You know, I'm a little, I'm a little lovey dovey nigga. You know what I mean? I want to cuddle with you and love you. You know, I'm one of them niggas. But as I got older and, and, and wiser, amen, I got the gift of goodbye. Don't you be afraid to put in the comment below. Y'all want some content? Now you got it. <laughs> and say, I got the gift of goodbye. Come on and talk to me. When people want to leave, you got to let them leave. When people want to walk, let them walk. Because guess what? They ain't the one. You ain't it. Peace. And you wonder why I have you guys going through anxiety, depression. Because you know why? You're, 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 you've been abandoned all your life. People have been ghosting you all your life. Honestly. I'm just like you. See, when you're chosen, I'm telling you, man, you've been abandoned and betrayed the majority of your life. I'm telling you. When you really chosen... We went through some of the most <laughs> heartbreaks. I'm talking about when you chose it, you went through some of the, so, so much betrayals, setbacks. But guess what? It, it never overcame you. It never conquered you. You conquered it because you're more than a conqueror. So if anybody want to walk, bye.
I'm not making you stay. I'm the chosen one. Don't you be afraid to put it in the comment below and say, I'm not making you stay. I'm the chosen one. And once you're in the season of celebrating yourself, putting God first, come on and talk to me. Once you have morals and standards now, amen, you realize that people really ain't on your level. Let's keep it 100. Let's keep it, let's keep it a buck. People ain't on your level. I'm talking about in the spiritual realm. This is I'll say, stay single until God finds you somebody real. Amen? You have to stay single. It's going to be hard to find somebody who is God-fearing. Amen? Who carry on the Holy Spirit with them and who always prayed up like you. It's hard to find that. But I promise you, if you be patient and wait on God, the right one is going to be right in front of you. He going to send them to you. You ain't got to go chasing nothing. Listen to me. I said you ain't got to go chase nothing. Do you know who you are? Do you know what you carry? Do you know that you are beautifully and wonderfully and fearfully made in the light and the image of God? You ain't got to chase nothing. Let me tell you something, man. I'm going to keep it 100 with you. Ever since I decided in my mind to stop chasing, I remember one of the videos I put out about Stop chasing or stop forcing it. That's what I really made up in my mind. I promise you. And this was like maybe what? Two months ago? I got a video like that two months ago. So you know what? I'm tired of chasing. I'm tired of, you know, making people trying to stay with me. I'm done with that shit. Once you stop forcing shit and live life, just let life flow, life's going to be so much better. Because everything going to be coming to you and you're going to be like, wow, this is how I should be living. People are going to be knocking on your door, trying to get your attention, trying to be in your presence. What part you don't understand that you are the chosen one? People should be holding the door open for you, man or woman. Who going to reciprocate the same energy? Okay, baby, you, you held the door open for me when we went out to dinner. Let me hold the door open for you this time. Ain't nobody doing that. They want you to do it for them every time. And they're not even chosen. Hello? I can see that they were chosen. Because I'm going to always be a gentleman and open the door for my queen. And any of my queens I had in the past, they know that. And that's why they just keep on coming back. Hey, don't you be afraid to put a comment below and say, you know I'm all that. And that's why you just keep on coming back. Let me tell you something. That's why you have to have the gift of goodbye. They're going to come back anyway. Can't find nobody real as you. You're chosen. Duh. <laughs> Don't you be afraid to put a couple blows and say, I'm chosen. Duh. I'm trying to tell y'all, y'all want content? Here it is. And I'm coming with unlimited content. I ain't got time to be playing. We got to make it to the, to the next level. So as we're on this journey, on this quest to finding our true love, first you got to know how to love yourself. Go out to eat by yourself. Half of y'all don't even want to go out to eat by yourself. Half of y'all scared to go out. Hey man, go, go. Yeah, have y'all scared to go partying by yourself? You be surprised. Go by yourself. You're going to see everything. Come on now. Start spending on yourself. Go take yourself shopping. Come on. Y'all forgot. Hey Amen. Guess what? You came in this world by yourself and you're going to leave by yourself. This is to all my single, single people. If you're lonely, get over it. If you feel lonely, get over it. And go in your bathroom and look in your mirror. Because let me tell you something. Manifestations is real. Affirmations is real. And look at yourself and say, you know what? As long as I got King Jesus, I really don't need nobody else. Just look at yourself in the mirror and say, I am beautifully and wonderfully, wonderfully and fearfully made in the likeness and image of God. Just look at yourself in the mirror and say, I am more than a conqueror. Look at yourself and say, hey, greater is he that is in me. Than he that is of this world. And you're going to feel so much better. Because guess what you're doing? You're training your mind. And then when you go out there, you're going to attract what you put out into that universe. Come on, talk to me. Whatever you send up there to God, you're going to attract it back. God getting ready to send you your twin flame. God getting ready to send you your soulmate. You ain't got to chase nothing. And guess what happens when you don't chase like that? This is how you know you're living a life of free will and you're flowing with life. Listen, when you got butterflies... That's always around you or in your presence. Listen to me. 
when you got butterflies that's always near you and around you. I'll never forget when I was around a butterfly, and the butterfly came right on my shoulder, like no cap. I mean, he wasn't there for a long time, but it was on my shoulder. I'm walking, my, the butterfly really on my shoulder. And then the butterfly just got on. You got to learn how to build your own garden and let the butterflies come to you. Because you got to realize butterflies, they're very, very sensitive to energy. And Charles Jones, guess what? You are very, we are very, we have very sensitive energy. We can feel it right away. So the minute you get a red flag when somebody got a negative energy, they demonic. Come on and talk to me. They don't really love like you. They don't really pray like you. They don't really believe in God like you. You got to ghost yourself before they ghost you. I promise you, ghost them and, and move on to the next. Because there's somebody out there. That is just for you. And you're going to know it right away. Can I get a witness? And even if you know it right away and then later on a red flag come, you got to ghost them. Bye. Because anybody show you who they really are, once they show you their true colors, you got to believe them. I don't give a damn how good they look. I don't care. I don't care how good it is in the bed. I don't care. Yeah. Learn how to move on with your life. Because you got to realize what you bring to the table. You got to realize the energy that you carry on you. It's a privilege to be in your presence, presence Charles You know I'm going to keep it 100 with you. I need everybody to share this video. I need everybody to share this video right now. If you single, share it. Because y'all out here just dating anybody. Hooking up with anybody. People be doing any and everything up under the sun. The devil is a liar. God getting ready to send you somebody who's fresh, clean. God getting ready to send you somebody, hey man, who love is just real and genuine. When they hug you, you're going to feel it. You're going to be like, wait a minute. Don't let me go. Come on and talk to me. When they shake your hand, you're going to feel it. Come on, talk to me. It's how you feel when you're in their presence. Because you got to know. When you chosen, the energy that you really bring and what you carry, man. I'm talking about, man, when people get in your presence, they really be like, wow. They be amazed, man. I'm telling you, man, you, you got that spark about you, chosen ones. I'm talking about when, when you meet people and you know they're not chosen, pay attention to how they act in your presence when you're real humble. Oh, they get so intimidated, man. Because you're a very, you're a very powerful spiritual being, amen. And only you're a powerful spiritual being. You carry the anointing. You carry the Holy Spirit with you. Come on. You got the fear of God over your life. You got the halo around you. You got the aura. Your aura is just bright. When your aura bright, God is with you. Sometimes you got to be telling me I have my aura in my pictures and I'll be seeing it. That means the Holy Spirit is with you. He's shining his light on you. Because guess what? You're really God's chosen one. What's done in the dark is going to always come out to the light, baby. Come on, can I get a witness? And this is why we have to stay in the fear and that mission of God. That's why we got to stay on our bended knees. Because the more you stay in the fear and that mission of God, the more, amen, you stay prayed up, the more power God gives you. And the more he sharpens your intuition, he sharpens your spirit of discernment. And people not even know why they're on the phone with you. You just as humble. You might talk a little bit, make them laugh. And come on and talk to me. But they're not even knowing you ready to hang up. The minute you hear any kind of red flag, come on and talk to me. Y'all know how it is when you dating. It's fun when you dating, get to know somebody on the phone. I'm bringing it back. It's fun. Don't nobody want to talk on the phone. Don't text me. You're going to have to call me. Come on and talk to me. It's, it's You know, you're on the phone. They're not even knowing. You let them talk, you let them talk, and your first mind like hang up. You like, wait, let me just keep keep on listening. And the more you just hear it, the more negative they get. And they talking about their past and they talking about their ex and they talking about this and, and they talking about how crazy they are and, and they talking about they'll they'll sock you and they and they'll, they'll hit you and then oh man, you, you, you gotta hear how they treat other people, how they treat the animals, how they treat they 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 kids. You listen to everything. And then I never know in the minute they hello, hello, click. Oh, where he? Where did he go? He gone, devil. He gone. 
You done messed up your opportunity with the chosen one. Come on, how many of y'all know that sometimes you got to really ghost these people like Casper the Ghost? Can I get a witness? Sometimes you can't tell people you're going to cut them off. Just cut them off. Cut the line off. Pull the cord out the wall if you got to pull the cord out the wall. You got to stay single until God find you somebody real. Can I get a witness in here? Because they just don't make them like you anymore, baby. So I know who this message is for, but enjoy your single life, man. I don't know about you, but I love being alone. So when you're chosen, when we by ourselves, we love it. And we love being around other people as well. But this is how you know you when you're really chosen. You cannot be around people for too long. Hello. That's when you really know you're chosen. God be like, okay, time to go, time to move. That's when you know you're chosen, you, when you're doing one of these. You're not even church. You're doing one of these at the family reunion. You know when you do, excuse me, you do this at the church. You're not even church. You're doing one of these at the family reunion. Time to roll. Because you're the chosen one. Come on. Don't you be afraid to hold it up. If y'all watching the video, hold your finger up. Time to roll. You gotta excuse yourself like you do in church. Because your energy is not welcome there anymore. And spirits be roaming around. I'm talking about on dates, especially on dates. We're not even talking about the family reunions anymore. We're gonna put them to the side and get and get to this get to your love life. We talking about when you going on these dates. Let me tell you something. The minute you feel negative energy, the minute you feel disrespected, just dismiss yourself. Don't even say don't even say a word. Because you really don't owe nobody nothing. You really don't owe nobody anything. And don't forget the people that ghosted you and you was real to them. It's a backwards ass world. What's up with this damn dating world? It's backwards. It don't matter what you do for people. When they will feel like leaving your ass, they gonna leave you. Come on and talk to me. They gonna hop on the next, the next Negro, the next female. You know what I'm about to say. Come on, talk to me. I'm trying to keep it PG-13. So when people leave you, let them go. Because there is nothing like a peace of mind. Wipe them weeping eyes. And know that, guess what? You are beautifully, wonderfully, and fearfully made in the likeness and image of God. And just know that as long as you got King Jesus, baby, guess what? You don't need nobody else. So you stay single until you can find somebody real. We the chosen ones, baby.